Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm making my first Irish recipe in my Irish kitchen or it's Airbnb kitchen with terrible light so excuse all the funny lights and shadows. It's eight o'clock in the morning but it's still dark so we just gotta do what we gotta do. So I will talk you through these ingredients to make pretty much the most amazing scrambled eggs I've ever had in my life. Um, I found this recipe online, adapted it, for, uh, changed from milk to cream because yeah with keto we like increasing our fat content. So um, we've got free range eggs, cream and butter, fresh Irish butter. So all these beautiful Irish ingredients are going to turn into scrambled eggs and I'm going to show you how. Right, we've got our butter and cream aside over there and we've just got our five eggs and we're going to beat our five eggs. Don't add the cream in, just beat the five eggs until smooth. Okay, just use a fork and you're just going to whisk. Don't these eggs look nice and healthy? Yeah. So we're going to whisk those they're smooth beautiful and now we're going to get on to melting our butter right i've enlisted the help of my husband till i have a tripod he will be holding my camera so i can do tasks like this so we've got the butter melting and now we're going to add a couple of tablespoons of cream into the frying pan okay maybe not one more so i'm making this for myself and my husband so we've got five eggs and a nice generous lot of cream and we're just going to let the butter melt and the cream just heat up a bit. It doesn't look too pleasant, but this is the secret to these eggs. We're going to warm up this cream, melt it with the butter, and then add our eggs in. And as you can also see, I've got my favorite red spot frying pan. As soon as I got here, I went and got it because I love this frying pan. And um, So you can see the butter is melted in gently into the cream. It's starting to get a little bit on the bubbly side. So we're going to add our eggs in now. Okay, so <laughs> this looks like egg. It's not. It's cream and butter. And we're going to pour our eggs in now. You can see that color difference between our bright eggs and cream in the background. I told you this light is just ridiculous here. But anyway, um, we're just going to give these a gentle stir. This is one of those lovely kitchen tasks that I find very therapeutic. So we need to constantly and consistently stir to gently scramble our eggs. And the lower you do this on, the slower they cook and the thicker they'll be. So it just takes a bit of patience. It might not look like much is happening, but I've got these on medium because I'm a little more impatient than most. Um, <laughs> but I would, I would say you have it as low as you, as low as you want to do it. But you can see some of it started scrambling and forming these beautiful scrambled eggs already. And I'll show you once they are scrambled. And you can see it started to form scrambled eggs. So just kind of keep mixing it through until it is cooked to your liking. And once it's done, that's very steamy here. Once it's done to my liking, I'll move it onto a plate and show you what it looks like. And look at that beautiful pile of scrambled eggs. This is definitely the most amazing method of making scrambled eggs. And I'm so happy I found it. Cooking the cream and the butter together, melting that through, and then adding the eggs. It just results in the fluffiest, creamiest scrambled eggs you have ever had. Now, you could just enjoy it by the plateful like I'm going to do here. You can add a bit of salt or seasoning to it. Enjoy it with your side of choice. Maybe a bit of creamy avocado might be a bit nice on the side. Um, but yeah, that's the recipe for today, my first Irish recipe out of my Irish kitchen, temporary Irish kitchen. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure that you leave a like and subscribe for more yummy inspirations just like this. And also leave a link down below to the recipe with us so you can make it yourself and follow along at home. Um, and leave me a comment as well. Let me know what you thought of this video and any other requests for some Irish recipes you'd like me to make keto. I look forward to reading your comments and we'll see you again soon. Bye.